So I don't think I vlogged all day from what I remember, but um, I was so busy because I was painting. <laughs> yes, I painted the whole thing. I mean, there's some nooks and crannies that I gotta touch up here and there, but um, I was thinking to myself, you know, the leather couch was so, or the leather um, seating was so bad that I had to buy something to repair it, and then I, I Googled it to see how to repair it, and it's basically paint, but like in a small section, so I- Blue drying. Okay, so what do you want me to do? Hold it, hold it up, and then you can pull the string. <clears throat> see how this has, this is all twisted. Mm -hmm. All right. Just um, go on this side. Keep it up while I do one piece at a time. So you see this red string? Mm -hmm. hold, hold on to this. Right? Okay, so... Um, right now we're going to glue down this piece right here. There's this. a sticker on it, so you can't... Sh don't go all the way. Up. Okay. You can't sh uh, shift it once it's down, or it's harder. Originally, we were going to do like steel or metal, but then we felt like that was too... like thick of an edge for the babies um, and so it was kind of dangerous so I purchased this on Amazon and it's like foam so you can um, you know have a little cushion in case the babies fall they hit something the corner edges then um, they won't have an issue as much of an issue of course it's going to be an issue if they fall but um, yeah so we're going to glue this down um, Gluing takes a little bit more effort because, you know, you have to hold it into place and glue does dry quick during the process of like doing this. So, but with nails, you can just nail it right away and it'll be stuck however you like. All right, and of course BK loves to have globs and globs of glue. It's his thing. It's okay. It'll help adhere better. Everything on this RV, we have to do extra, extra. Because it's a moving vehicle. And so, we have to, um, yeah. Kind of like secure everything down. So there we have it. You want to do the rest? You do uh, it, huh? I need to shave that. Huh? You want to edge here, huh? Yeah. I should shave that edge. Hold on. So, you can see. See, we nailed this. So that's why it's more secure. And Brian also glued it because he's extra. But this, we're not nailing. We're just going to um, glue it. Anyways, um, I was saying that I was painting the... Um, I was painting the... Um, Couches or no the leather seats because I was looking on the internet and it's basically ah, loud over there. It's basically paint but in small form. So I'm like, okay, I might as well just paint the whole thing. And I googled that if you can paint it, and it turns out that you can paint it. So just you have to use acrylic, and um, it'll be better. So I'm like, all right, you just paint it. And just hope that um, it doesn't, you know, have an issue. I know the other day I was painting and um, I kind of dripped some black paint here and it took forever to get out. So I'm like, if it's taking forever to get out of this, then it's going to be forever to take out of this. And I even painted the, um, the seat belts. I mean, that basically just like ate into it. Like it's not even, it's not even coming off because it's... It's like leather or some sort of fabric, so it's staying on. So, yeah, that's that. That's what we have. Um, I think it looks great. It's just I need to touch up. I was like kind of in between babies, so all this I have to kind of paint. And I probably will, uh, I'll probably do it tomorrow because I can see better in the day. But this whole area was all brown. <laughs> I didn't like it, so I painted everything. It was this brown and a little darker brown so I'm gonna have that situated and figured out um, so they say to use acrylic paint in, on leather or pleather because it has a little bit of glue and so it keeps everything together and it also stretches because it's acrylic it's like plastic basically 
So I did buy some furniture cover for it just in case something, you know, there's an issue. If all, you know, goes bad, then we can always get new chairs. But I just wanted to see if this works out. And so far, I think it looks pretty good. Um, yeah, there are some areas that were like really scuffed up. So the paint will just hold on to it and we'll see how it uh, performs on the road. Do you need help? Uh, probably some blue tape to hold it. Blue up. tape? Okay. Where can I get blue tape? In the garage? Okay. If not, I'll use electrical tape. Right now we're working on the backsplash. This is one of the first things that we did but we never finished. It's now the last, almost. Only a few more things to do. I gotta finish painting up. Um, curtain rods everywhere. And, um, what do you call it? Backsplash in the bathroom and then the um, master room. We gotta put the flooring on the bed area and possibly the marble acrylic on the bed bottoms. We'll see. But we're we're really close. Looking very good. Alright, we're doing trims. We just got one in right here. And now we're gonna do this one. We have to, we have to cover all that ugliness up there. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna set the camera right here while we uh knock it in. Good luck to you. Keep it flat. Of course, Brian has the glob, the glue. Push yours in first and then I'll pull one. Okay, mine's pushed in. Trims are in. Looking good. We got the lighting going. Um, just little details to really finish up this project. Caulking in here, you know, all that good stuff. And uh, we pulled in the um, RV so that it looks proper from the outside. Cause it's kind of crazy but yeah lots of things to do tomorrow i think we can knock it out a few more punch lists and we're good yeah. good morning good morning sweetheart it's, it's charging yeah it's charging ready for school no. so um early mornings with my babies we just I heard the news about the shooting in Texas and I just cannot believe it. Like, it just is so heartbreaking. And it's like really Mommy. sad. Daddy. Because they're just kids. Daddy. They're just babies. Daddy. The world is like crazy. And we're just... Daddy. It's really hard. It's Daddy. Gone. Yeah, it's charging, honey. Life went on. Mommy. People do things like that. Go, it's just ridiculous. Go, mm -hmm. go. Okay, so um. Mommy, go. Scooper, the um iPad's not working. Okay, it's charging. Okay, just wait. Okay. So I fed um Rain, and now I'm feeding Sky. And I'm gonna take care of their diapers in a moment. Right after this, they're all full diapers. <sighs> Crazy world. Hey, why are we crying? It's been a long day. Scooper has been sick, but I've been trying to monitor him. Just picked him up from school. Got him a chicken quesadilla, a burrito bowl, and um, yeah, juice. Yes. You, okay, okay, okay. You have to eat your chicken quesadilla, okay? Mm -hmm, okay, okay. Say yes. Okay. Been a long day. Finally got some food. I love this drink right here. Grapefruit. Scooper is really picky. He doesn't want to eat his quesadilla. He wants his strawberries. And iPad. Getting difficult. Getting very difficult. We have cleaned up in this area. Hasn't been a day since trash has been dumped. And look, all three trash can filled with cardboard. This is empty for us to use for throughout the whole weekend. And um, yeah, it feels good to just clear out everything for reals. Right now, Brian's still working on the RV, just doing radio stuff. We finally got it done. It's been a couple hours. He said one hour, but it's been a couple hours. And I 
we'll have to do my curtains tomorrow because it's getting late. And let's go check out this restroom area or bedroom. Ah, looking good. And I stocked this up. Pillows, throws, baby station. This is diaper, formula, etc. We got towels. We got pillows. And we have um, comforters and um, bed sheets because in case we um, decide to camp outside, then we have that all there. And then Brian just put in the um, backsplash here. We have extra, so I figured, you know, we might as well use it. It looks pretty good. He knocked it in and also he got rid of um, the big bulging thing that came out. I'm going to um, try to add more stuff to this room because I want to make it really nice and cozy. Um, here's a candle. But right here, you see, this is where the um, wallpaper was ripped off. So I'm going to cover it with um, um, a hand soap and a lotion right here somehow. So we'll cover that ugliness because I don't want to patch it right here and right here. So there we have it. I'll come in tomorrow. So we'll do that. And um, yeah, this too, Brian. Don't yeah, forget. I gotta find the screw. Don't forget. All right, it has been quite a day. I didn't get to vlog much. Ooh, dirty. Brian's always scuffing up everything. I literally just like scuff up, scuff up, and I have to cock this. This is not cute at all. Look at that. And um, look. He just keeps scuffing up stuff. Oh my God, it's so annoying. Why like, can't he just keep everything in neat? It's like I make everything perfect and he just ruins everything. Um, restroom, put the towels in. Um, long towels, short towels. Uh, trash can. We're going to get a little scrubber thingy. And extra essentials. We have to have the poopery Because, you know, you don't want to smell bad. So... That's knocked in here somewhere. Oh, it doesn't fit. Anyways, this is for um, like toothpaste, toothbrush, all that good stuff. It'll come in soon, so yeah. Um, we gotta clean out this. I don't know what this is, but it's pretty crappy. So yeah. Um, going to add a bottle of wine later. This is a serving tray, and uh, just chill out. I'm gonna enjoy this in a few days. Ready to rock and roll. Do you like the chair? Yeah. yeah. I was so busy today, I didn't get a chance to vlog much. This is my first time picking up the camera. I picked this up from um, Home Goods because I went to do an essential run for the RV. Um, we are heading out to Joshua Tree maybe later tonight or tomorrow morning. And I didn't even show it to him. He just pulled it aside and sat on it. It's so cute. You're so cute, honey. You like the chair? Yeah, so um, I'm going to take a shower for the boys, get ready, pack all the stuff and essentials, whatever. It's a lot, so hopefully we make it on time. It's 7.30 p.m. No rush, though, really. We're just uh, we're being extra. Okay, let's take a shower. All right, so we were not able to go today, but we were able to get the curtains in. Um, right here and there as well. I got this cute chair for Scooper to hang out and chill. Put up a little chandelier. It's not a chandelier, like, connected electric. It's just like a candle holder, and I figured it's easier because then you can maneuver around it and you don't have to wire it. So lots of mess, but we're gonna try to leave really early in the morning, hopefully. And then um, we have Brian here talking to my sister. She's supposed to be here, we're supposed to leave, but she's not. So we're gonna chill, clean up, and then leave in the morning. 
That one is, doesn't even have batteries, but it is one something, 114 actually. So let's um, let's play pretend 114, 115. No, no, it's just 1215, so one. So. Okay, so before I go, we just put in the bed, and Brian's testing it out. Making sure it's like nice and sturdy. Is it good? How's it feel? I have pillows. <laughs> That's what I said. We have to have rails so the kids sleep there. It's like, what the heck? Where are they sleep? I'm sure Scooper's gonna eventually want to climb up and down. It's cool, huh? Okay. You want to help me with pillows then? Yeah, it does, because these are heavy ass pillows. Okay. Um, there's like these memory foam ones, like super heavy.